I kind of like maybe they under, they thought I was pro Palestinian, which later on that's what I wanted to tell you that like I happen to have a, a, a Jewish flag that I got in Beverly Hills after October eight. Yeah. I supported like when um, I don't know if you heard of in Ventura County there was a name um, named uh, John Clazer. Placer, a 69-year-old Jewish man that was hit in the head. That's, I want to really, I get that. No, but you, what I'm trying, I'm saying this, I'm stating this mostly because if I didn't have that Jewish flag, I would have got more viciously attacked. That Jewish flag was literally the reason why they were like, oh, you're on our side. And then they started to kind of be more like apologetic and more like, hey, my bad, da 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 Now, if I didn't have that Jewish flag, this press pass was not going to protect me. My my the having rights was not gonna protect it. So that's why I feel like that was racially motivated. Now another thing is this as a journalist, I also got other videos of them dragging a, a daily brewing um now, now I learned that he's a daily brewing journalist. He is an, another black uh, kid of color. Mm -hmm. You know, he looked way younger than me. I'm a thirty three year old man, you know? Mm -hmm. Now when you're attacking nineteen to twenty three year olds in a way that you're getting attacked by a 45-year-old. You're getting attacked by grown men, you know? So um, 